Hi there. Uh, carrying on with the uh, mercury vapour discharge lamps. Um, I've got a re reflector lamp made by, well, it's got the Crompton name on it. Who it was actually made by, I don't know. It's possibly made by Phillips. But it's got the Crompton name on it. I'll show you the insides. I've had these these ones for quite a while now. I think I bought a job lot. Um, you know, you get stuff from, from job lots and they normally work out quite a bit cheaper. There's the arc tube in there. Once again, it looks brand new. It's, it looks like it's never never been lit. It obviously needs a starter gear for this. One of these days, if I get a hold of any starter gears, which I'm not particularly interested in, I'll show it working. Anyway, we've got a little etch on there. If I can bring that up. It's just getting it in the right spot. Let me see that, okay. Right, as you see, it's Crompton. It's made in Belgium. Which would prompt me to think it's either made by Philips or uh, Sylvania. I may be wrong, but um, as I say, that was... I can't get this etch right. You know, I might be able to show it better, put it in the light. There we are, there's the etch. Get a bit closer and hold it on there. Okay. 125 watts. The lamp as a whole. My hand to give you an idea of the size. I'm rather pleased today because I've rejoined the lighting gallery net. Um, also under the same name Miget One. I use Miget for um, several uh, things. It commemorates one of my lovely pussy cats I lost. Miget was a beautiful Siamese cat, and uh, she was taken away with, um, unfortunately, cancer. That was a good many years ago now. Anyhow, there's the lamp. Uh, Edison screw base. What else can I say about it? Nothing else, I don't think. Any comments, feel free to mention. Once again, I've answered all the other people, all the other people that have answered things, and I'm very grateful to them. I sort of do my answering early in in the morning, so it sort of gets it all clear. Anyhow, thanks again for watching, and I'll get back with another lamp. Thanks again.